All right, welcome back. Well, it's hard during this period to uh, leave football uh, because of all the things happening uh, in the world of sports. But of course, there are other things happening elsewhere. And today, uh, usually it's Friday we talk about chess, but today uh, we're going to do that for you, uh, talk about chess. We have a big fish uh, in the house, and um, I'm going to introduce him shortly, uh, but also we have someone who uh, decides what happens in Nigeria, talking about chess as well. So uh, it's a double dose for you uh, on uh, the show. But let me quickly uh, introduce... Um, uh, Nigel Short uh, to uh, to you tonight. It's good to have you, uh, Jonas. He's a grandmaster of chess. That's right. <laughs> so uh, anyway, great to be here. Uh, and also the uh, NCF president, Nigeria Chess Federation president, uh, Mr. Leko Adeyemi. It's good to have you, Jonas. Thank you. Thank All right. You. And it's, it's interesting to have you guys, but I, I want to start with you, Nigel. And yeah. um, we're seeing you here. We're used to reading about you. We're used to hearing a lot of things about you. But the first question that comes to mind, why are you Nigeria? Um, well, originally, uh, it was <coughs> conceived as a, a, a tour of coaching and uh, chess promotion, and I've done quite a number of <coughs> these tours um, in Africa. I'm sorry. Yeah, no, <coughs> no problem. And um, uh, a, few, a couple of months ago, I um, uh, decided to run for the presidency of the World Chess Federation for FIDE. So As a governing fact, body. The governing body, yeah. So uh, my tour has uh, morphed a bit, and it's got much more of a political angle now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but you're in Nigeria majorly because of uh, the coaching clinics and all that? That's right. Okay. Uh, l l let, me al let me also ask you, uh, when you say things like this, somebody, the next thing somebody will say, what are your plans? What, what makes you think you can make a difference? Uh, what do you mm -hmm. want to do? What changes uh, do you want to you know, <clears throat> see in FIDE? Well, there are many things. Uh, right now, the reputation of the World Chess Federation is absolutely at rock bottom. Um, the uh, FIDE president, Kizan Ilyamzhinov, appeared on the U.S. Treasury Department sanctions list in November 2015. And uh, since then, there have been problems with opening a bank account. Uh, so uh, 18 major banks simply refused to have any dealings uh, with FIDE. Um, and um, so I'd like to see the reputation of the organization restored that's a big goal and yes and and to uh, then attract commercial sponsorship because i believe it is uh lining up it's queuing up uh to sponsor the ultimate mind sport okay all right uh, do you have people you intend to uh, to work with uh, you know it's, it's an ambition that's going to take you a, a lot of places. You need support. You're probably not going to do it. So in, in this part of the world, do you have people you intend to uh, put well, on the picture? Yes. Well, um, I'm uh, planning to uh, announce my ticket over um, the next uh, two or three weeks. And I'm very pleased this, this evening to uh, announce the first person uh, okay. uh, on my ticket, the gentleman sitting on my right. Uh, President uh, Lakem. Okay. <laughs> All right. uh, since, since you just, since you mentioned, since you mentioned that, uh, maybe I should just go to him uh, and 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 ask him. You know, in Nigeria as well. You know, apart from, you know, you tend to hear about chess, and but your ratings of how the game has grown uh, is mm -hmm. is what I want to ask you. And before we talk about the other things. But I just quickly want to ask you, because people, when they hear these associations and all that, they, the first question is, what are they doing? What has been happening? But I know you guys have been quite busy, but people don't get to hear what you're doing. Yeah, thank you. I, I, I don't want to dwell too much on um, Nigeria today, okay. tonight. But I want to say that I've been president for four years at counting, and um, achievements are enormous. Okay. When, we became president, when I became president, um, we are just... Um, 26 Jalaba players rated in Nigeria. Okay. And uh, now we have uh, 200 players rated. We have said that here before. 
and um, also, we also have about 70 to 80 players titled as against about um, a few, like 10, when we became president. So those are the indices, parameters used in measuring um, chess development in Nigeria. Of course, the number of chess um, um, participation in chess is, That's is, going is, exactly. is huge now. It's highly increased. Chess activities in schools is, um, is enormous, it's tremendous, and it's laudable. So um, I don't want to speak much about that, but yeah, we, we are making steady progress. Okay. Remarkable progress. <laughs> uh, okay. All right, let, let me go back to um, uh, uh, Nigel and, and, and talk about... <coughs> you've been here for a while. Um, I'm not talking about administration. I'm just talking pure law for the game. Yeah. What have you said? What, pure, hearing, hearing, yeah, the, hearing Nigeria, Nigeria about well, law for the um, game? You, well, this is actually only my first full day. Uh, okay. So... Um, what, what I can say, that people are very enthusiastic, and Nigeria is clearly the, clearly the regional powerhouse. Um, so uh, there are uh, developments. I would like to see further developments. I think if uh, more people are uh, reached, uh, then um, uh, I, I think it's only a matter of time before Nigeria yeah. gets its first grandmaster. Yes, that would be, be very good. I'm going to ask two of you a question. We're pressed for time, but I want you to clarify this for me. Mm. Is, is chess an elitist game or is it all comers? You know, somebody yeah. sees a group of people playing chess and think, oh, you have to have a certain level of IQ to be able to play chess, or this is just for some certain people. Is it an all comers, or right. just have to have a certain level of IQ? I think uh, chess is for everyone obviously uh, smarter people are going to uh, succeed but you know um, you could say that basketball is is only for tall people <laughs> okay <laughs> so, okay all right uh, Mr. Le uh, Lecon well, yeah, I'll not sport uh, I, I believe every sport you take part in has a way of uh, molding you mm -hmm. and I think um, even if a dollar plays chess chess will mold that person a chess player is actually above mm -hmm. average Right. And, and it's, it's for old and for young, and it doesn't matter whether you're handicapped or not. It's, yeah. it's one of the nice Everybody. things about uh, the game of chess, that it's, it's really for everyone, from Everybody. rich rich or poor. It's, it's not an expensive game to play. You get a chess set, board and pieces, it's a few dollars, not more. So uh, it should be a game uh, that uh, everyone uh, is introduced to. Uh, all right, let me, let, let me get to you, Leko, and let, let me just ask you, a few years down the line, what are the things you hope to see uh, in, in Nigeria, talking about chess, uh, in, in terms of growth? I know you've yeah. said that it's grown remarkably already, but yeah. what are the things you love to see? Yes, we, we want to increase the level of chess awareness in Nigeria. We want to increase the um, level of chess participation in Nigeria. We want to have a first grandmaster in Nigeria, and I hope we will achieve How that. How close are we to that? Yes, we're close, but... Um, it's pretty, pretty difficult to have, to, to have a grandmaster. Like I said somewhere today, it's, it's easier to make a professor than to make a grandmaster. <laughs> yes, we it's have professors in Nigeria. Easier. We don't have any grandmaster <laughs> of chess in Nigeria. We don't have in the West, in West Africa. We don't have in East Africa. We only have four in the whole of Africa. So it's, 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 it's a lot of work. It's a lot of hard work. All right, guys, uh, I want to thank you, Nigel. I wish you yeah. well. Uh, okay. Hopefully. Uh, okay. Thanks. <laughs> hopefully, uh, we'll get to hear more about you. Yeah. And Lekon as well. Lekon Adeyemi is the uh, Nigeria Chess Federation uh, president. Uh, continue with the good work. And hopefully, Nigeria will get our grandmasters soon. <laughs> All right. And uh, thank you as well for allowing us to be a part uh, of your day today. We'll do this again tomorrow. I'm Yemi Adebayo. Bye bye now.